Alright, so let's talk Tesla stock here. Nice day, you got up 56% right on Monday. Tuesday's coming up, got Q2 deliveries. I don't know the numbers yet. Maybe by the time the video comes out, you already know the numbers before me. Um, hope it goes up another 10%. It'll go up to 219, 220s. My friend's telling me if it stays above 209, it might go up to 230s. If it goes below 209, it might it'll pull back to the uh, 170 to 190 zone. So. I don't know, those are just some short-term indicators for you, but really long-term, you know, we got, yeah, we got the delivery numbers, they never turn out that well, but maybe I'm hoping, you know, this is the time where it goes well, and then you got the earnings in two weeks or something, and then you got 8, eight RoboTaxi Day, so a lot of bullish indicators, uh, maybe it will keep pushing up to then. But Tesla stock never really does well on the on the big days, right? It just never does well. A run up and then a crash. But that's maybe the old Tesla, maybe the new Tesla is different. So yeah, got this interesting background backdrop here. Um, yeah, checking out Korea. Uh, it's pretty nice. Definitely recommend. Good food, shopping. Good prices, affordable prices, meals for $8, $15 meals. So, um, you know, you can't really get that back in the States. You got $25, $30 meals. So, so hopefully it goes well. I'll try to, hopefully I can post this video before the earnings or before the numbers. But if you get the numbers, then we'll, we'll figure out tomorrow on Tuesday. Figure out Tuesday. I'm ready on Tuesday. But you guys are still on Monday night, but um, check it out.